What's up guys, I'm Andy here today and welcome back to GTA 5. Tell the architect and get the plans. Oh. Hey stupid! You can't be on here without a hat! Um, yeah, thanks a lot. Thanks! Site inspection! Architect on site! <clears throat> I totally look like I'm supposed to be here with this hat. Those idiots drilled the new caissons on the west side. You're kidding me. The bedrock ends there. We need caissons on the east side. Ah, uh, no drama. It's a government contract. We'll be paid until completion. I ain't taking a fall for this screw up. It's a government contract. No one's taking a fall. Except the government. Oh, he's going up. Study him and study him hard. I was gonna wipe my ass on him. That's the engineer's plan. Mine you treat like a religious text, remember? Yeah, that's it. Who's that? Who are you? I'm supposed to sign off on all. <coughs> No, no. Shoot the cops. Oh, jeez. Oh, great. Oh, 
Oh, jeez. Alright, let's go. Inside. Ah, it's Craig. Hey, you got him? Of course I do, homie. Here. Thank you. So, all good? Sure, homie. So is this shit for real? We just gonna rob the FIB and be allowed to walk by your boys like that. Yeah, I don't fucking know. Probably not. All right, Lester, what do you got? Uh, I don't quite know yet. Give me a minute. I'm not a fucking computer. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, maybe I am. <laughs> Here's what I think. We have two options. The new security software goes into containment mode in case of emergency, you know, uh, Earthquakes, mudslides, acts of God. So we could plant some fire bombs. They go bang. The emergency call goes out. We hijack it, show up as firemen, and then we grab the containment drive. Or we could hack the system on site. We'll go in by uh, by air. Uh, hope we don't run into too much physical resistance. Sounds relaxing. Either bombing our office ran by the vision of corrupt government psychos, or. Defeating one of the world's most complex security systems using our worthless ass ninja skills, huh? Yeah. Any, many, money, mo. If you favor the firebomb containment drive option, you'll go in with that janitor's ID you picked up. It'll be at night when most of the workers are off. You mop the place and plant the bombs where we need them. Seriously? I got a mop? Yeah, yeah, you really do. They'll clock you on the cameras if you're play acting. You also need a fire truck to show up in when the bombs go off, and a getaway car stashed in a quiet place near the bureau so you can torch the truck and get out. The car doesn't have to be anything special. There shouldn't be any heat. Well, what about the other way, with the uh, ninja skills? Now you choose that route, you won't be using the janitor's gear, but we had to cover all the bases. Your FIB paymasters will have to provide you with a chopper and a pilot. Now you fly way up above the building, parachute in, and gain access to the roof here. Now, you'll need to be armed to the teeth, mind you, just in case the, uh, shit goes down. Mopping or parachuting? Wow, you're making this choice really difficult. Now, Haynes has given us the leftover money from the Polito job to pull this mission, and the crew will be paid out of that. We keep the change. So, what's it gonna be? Uh, well, I'm not really a huge fan of flying, so... <laughs> so you do want them up, okay? Well, you'll need a couple of gunmen. They'll go in with you as firemen. Everything goes to plan. They won't fire a single bullet, but you will be running into a burning high-rise with them, so consider that. Gus Moda. Yeah, He's a pro. Not much else to say. Daryl, yeah. uh, I'm not hearing great things, to be honest, but you just might be able to do this with him. Okay. We got someone Does who's that really all look good, good to you? Fine. You are robbing the FIB here. <laughs> And we have a winner. I'll make the arrangements and call you when we're ready. All right, shit, hit me. You know, um, I'm still looking into that Union Depository gig. It's real interesting. But I don't know if we can do it without you-know-who. Uh, well, as long as he can't do it without us. Getaway vehicles required for this setup. Hey, Sugar Plum. Daddy, I'm in trouble. What is it? Money? Drugs? Your mother. There's this guy. He's been following me around. I think he's about to do something. 
going to help her. What the heck? Linwood Plaza. Okay, wait there. He's been following me in my car, so let's just drive around and you can talk to him when he shows. Oh, yeah. We'll talk. Don't leave my car here then. Let's go find him. We should try over at Hawaiian Snow for him. We're looking for a guy in a purple convertible. I don't remember what make. Okay, I'll keep an eye out. Thanks, Daddy. Hey, what are dads for, huh? I mean, other than giving you money, putting a roof over your head, speaking to guys who ridicule you on TV. Is he here? No, he's not around. Oh, hey, we buddy. should try that motel opposite the big construction site. Where'd you meet this guy? Uh, at a signing? What are you signing? A pot petition? So you better not be taking out credit like your brother. Not credit. Did you see him? I don't think so. Maybe we should look over at Cluck and Bell. Rockford Plaza. I, I was... Signing autographs at the expo. People want to meet you after that video on fame or shame? We found this prick? Not yet. Okay, uh, how about going around the corner and back up the hill past Crockahoop? My baby girl's a celebrity with her very own stalker. You finally made it, Dad. You raise your kids in Rockford Hills. What was I thinking? Yeah, you know, it's amazing you've turned out this good. Ah! Purple car! That's him! Fuck! He's on you! Let's go! Let's hit the after this. Am I stopping? Hey, what are you running for, pal? Let's talk! Seriously! I didn't know she already had a sugar daddy! What? He's not so creepy when there's a grown man in the car. I swear he was gonna do something, Dad. Yeah, well, now we're the ones who are gonna do something. All kinds of things. I didn't ask for a psycho, Dad! Unbelievable! Hey, Creepo! Oh, I'm her father, dad. not a sugar daddy! Shut I'm sorry up. this happened to you, baby. There's some real creeps out there. Yeah, guys who go to strip clubs, use hookers. Hey, 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 that ain't me anymore. Hello, precious cargo. Come on, come on. She's a lovely young woman. You've done a great job. Yeah, well, it's hard raising kids in this town. Come here, scumbag! Jeez! Well, you don't see me driving! You gotta get him, Dad! I can't live like this! What are you living like? I can't go out of the house! I can't go online! Well, then how do he find you on the web? My, um, my... fan site, you know? Everything's so... connected now, these days. You just killed him! I can't believe it! Pop, I think the cops want to talk to you! It's fine.
Honestly, I don't think there was any other way to do that. And if there was, oh well. That was a lot of cops. You're a danger to yourself and others. Okay, shut up. Be sure. I just wanted you to speak to him. This was infinitely more persuasive. I never should have called you. Look, there's a lot of sickos out there. I couldn't take the chance. I know there are sickos out there. My dad is one of them. Uh, grow up, baby. It's time you got serious with your life. Yeah, I ain't perfect, but I love you. I guess he really scared me, but I, I didn't want... Well, then pretend it never happened. Like, I try not to think about exactly what aspect of your creative expression enamored him so much. Okay, that's right. Denial kind of works for me. Good. That's my girl. Now, please, try to make better choices. We've dealt with that crazy. You don't have to drive like a maniac. I'm a little keyed up, okay? I need to wind down. Maybe speeding and hitting people and swerving all over the place isn't the best way to relax. Thanks, Daddy. Bye. I'm glad I could use my paternal rage productively for once. Where's my dang car? Nowhere. All right, well, taking your car. Oh, I'm not gonna use it for getaway. I'm uh, going to leave this part here. I hope you enjoy and I hope to see you next time. Bye.